Hey you guys, one of these days I'm gonna start out with my makeup done and my hair done. But right now we're getting ready for Abby's birthday party. We don't have a whole lot that we're gonna do. I'm gonna put some tissue paper back in this bag just for decoration. She just made brownies over there. So we'll put brownies on here. She's gonna put her iPad away. And then she's got some drinks ready for some lemonade and plates ready for pizza and dinner. And we're gonna run really quick to go to the dollar store. Oh, I'm coming. She's wanting to go. I understand. We're, I know, we're late. I know. We're late and we're gonna go get some balloons and some decorations for her party along with the pizza because we're gonna go to the lake if this like weather will, uh, you know, get better. So we're on a time crunch. So let's go to the dollar store. All right, we picked up balloons, and we also got, Abby got a little treat for each of the girls. And we got sodas. And then they decided last minute to do some Italian sodas while we're having our pizza. I thought that was kind of fun, because I don't think we're gonna get to stay at the beach for very long. I think it might heat up, but I don't know that the sun's gonna come out a whole lot. So a lot of the friends couldn't come. It's just a rough time of year to have a birthday. <laughs> Because everyone's still on vacation or starting like school camps or you know like soccer camps and whatnot so but those balloons are kind of cute mm -hmm. right that'll look good let's go home and set it up all right we got a few balloons nothing fancy there's Chelsea she's making herself some lunch Abby and Ashley are having a quick bite to eat I'm gonna go get a little bit more cleaned up I'm having myself a quick bite myself just because we're not eating at the at the lake today. We're just having snacks. I wanna like feed everyone lunch and dinner today. So, I mean my kids I will feed lunch and dinner. <laughs> I meant for the birthday party. They're staying till like 9.30 tonight, so I didn't wanna have to like do two meals. So I'm gonna quickly kind of fix this mess here. I don't think I'm gonna put my swimsuit on yet. Some of the girls are even gonna change here themselves. So, anyway, we have a kind of a fun makeshift you know birthday set up there for Abby and it's kind of fun all right we're at the beach right Ash where are you right there and uh, got Abby and her friends here but won't show them too much just this cutie right here we have Chelsea with us too Kaylee stayed home with friends she's out shopping doing something and then she has to babysit tonight so it'll just be me and the little ones Kind of hanging out and like, yep, I knew it. There wouldn't be anyone at the beach today. There's some kind of an event going on behind us, but no one at the beach. So I'm kind of thinking it's kind of bright. It's like not bright, but it is bright. Um, so Ashley's already gotten out. Actually, they've already all gotten out. Are they gonna go back in, do you think? Do they say they're getting out for good? Well, I think so. I don't know. I don't really understand. <laughs> Sometimes I don't understand teenagers. They all, all the girls went back to the bathroom. Three of them didn't even bring towels for themselves when literally all we're supposed to be doing for the majority of this time is playing at the lake. So it's like, bring a swimsuit and a towel? <laughs> I don't know what part of the memo they missed. They but they better not be like showering and being done. We've literally been here for maybe 20 minutes. I don't want to be here anymore. I know, because you don't have any friends. Looks like there's some kind of a little baptism going on over there at the water. But um, Chelsea usually has someone to play with and it's a little bit warmer. Is the water warm or cold? Coldish. Coldish? Just the sun's not here to warm it up, huh? So, I, so I didn't even set up the umbrella. I just left everything in the wagon. <laughs> put out the mat for Ashley to sit on. I'm worried about her being in the water just because of her cough and so she's been out for most of this time. She's just playing in the sand and that's fine. I don't care if they just sit here and play in the sand or even go over to the park. Do you want to go over to the park when they come back? So I just don't want to go home yet because we're gonna get pizza on our way home but and a movie. But, Chelsea and me are gonna be but like if we go home and do that it's gonna be like five o'clock when we're done with all that and they're supposed to stay till 9 30. Which I can send them home earlier, I guess, if we're done, but I don't know. I hope they have fun. I don't know, we'll just see how it goes. So 
Tell me what you got. Minion that's really creepy. It's a little way creepy. <laughs> Is it good? The eyes are um, falling out. This are they one. blueberries? They look like blueberries. No, they're gum. Oh, they're gum? Abby has the one I got. Did you get another one? <laughs> Did Abby not want that one? Yeah. That's all right. You can have it, huh? A little bored, it was cold, and a little ready to go home. <coughs> Problem is, the older girls went out to this little sandbar, kind of tucked away in a little bay. So, we thought we would just go for a walk on the little trail and see if we can find them and then see if they're ready to go home or at least just enjoy a nice walk. And this one is just ready to go home, huh? Wasn't the best day to come for a lake for her. Needed a couple more days of getting better with this cough, but <coughs> see. But I needed to come for Abby's birthday. And once again, there's no friends home. So make do. <laughs> so Chelsea, this is where you came for your field trip. So she knows all these little stations. What one was this one? Oh, this one was um, also another beaver one. They learned about beaver tails, yeah. right? All about what kind of fish? The lakes and uh, What kind of salmon? Kokanee. Yes, the kokanee salmon. You did a whole unit on the kokanee salmon, didn't you? Yeah, right. Now we go after the little sandbar, right, Ashley? Big yeah. Are those from Bigfoot? <laughs> you think? Well, um, at Granddaughter Days, um, we found this ginormous foot on our this, the trail. The campfire, the campfire. We found two of them. Oh, do you think there's a Bigfoot or a Sasquatch? I uh, know. <laughs> right there. <laughs> So Chelsea already walked around there, didn't she? Yeah, she already did. There's all the girls. For a little while this is the remnants of Abby and her pizza party <laughs> there's one plate there two pizzas gone over there and then the girls ate here I'm just now sitting down and Abby is a stinker she didn't want to be filmed opening her presents from her friends so she opened them while I was in the shower little stinker I don't even know where she put them so she's kind of being a pill and they're up at the park just kind of playing and hanging out the girls are abby and her friends and ashley is right here she's kind of hanging out trying to convince her to go to bed oh you're home sorry he's been home for a while i just hadn't put, pulled out the camera for a bit i'm gonna the girls are at the park 
we gotta we're convince gonna, her I'm to go for we're really really red with this light hang on yeah we're gonna convince her to go upstairs to watch a show on the ipad and then i'm gonna go for a run okay get her to bed first though by myself ashley he thinks he's funny let's go on up and cut so out the bed. they're gonna come back from the park and then watch a movie and let's see what did we get goosebumps it's for kaylee and er, chelsea and ashley and house of with a clock the house with the clock and the and its walls is for ashley and chelsea and abby got the hate you give it's a little too serious i thought for like a girl's movie night but it's what they picked out. One of the girls wanted a rated R movie about, I think it's called the eighth grade. And she's like, oh, this is perfect. It'll teach us about being in eighth grade. I'm like, no, you're not watching a rated R movie to learn about being in eighth grade. <laughs> not gonna happen. Luckily I was in there when they were picking him out so that I could monitor what movie was picked. So I, I'm just gonna respect Abby. She doesn't like the camera on very much. And so I will respect her wishes. What are you doing back there? I was watching a video of a, a, a sound engineer and he's um, critiquing old songs like uh, Def Leppard, Pyromania. And? That's that, why I was bobbing my head because it's a cool song. Oh, all right, okay, whatever. All right, so that's where we're at. I'm gonna actually edit videos today. Let me come in here in the other room. Oh, I don't need the fan on anymore. It barely hit 74 today. So it feels nice and cool with the window open. I am just going to set myself up here at my desk. I have four videos to edit, including today's video. And that will put me, if I can get them all edited today and tomorrow, I will be two weeks scheduled out. So you're gonna start, you guys are going to start seeing this stuff you know, in the next two weeks or whatever. Just know that I'm I'm scheduled out to help with my sanity. It really like makes me feel good to be prepped and have videos ready to go so far in advance. It puts a lot less pressure on me to, you know, have to sit and work a lot when they're still here at home. I don't think we have super good temperatures in terms of going to the beach or going to a pool or going and doing major water activities for the rest of the summer until Labor Day. We do a boating activity for church on boat on Labor Day. But I do have, let's see if I can find them, move, or I have passes to go to the zoo. Yeah, I just found it. So Woodland Park Zoo over in Seattle, I asked the kids if they wanted to go and do that and they were all very excited, including Abby. She thought, oh, that's way fun. She's like, for our field trip, I was, you know, not as excited about going but she's like it was way fun so I might do that with them next week and I have an activity for church I'm not done videoing tonight we'll keep going do little bits here and there as the girls are kind of hanging out and whatnot but just kind of hanging out until they come back from the park all right are we gonna get a drink yeah okay what are we adding first um I add this so add the lemonade you want me to help Okay. Do you want to add a little Sprite to it? Um, no. Okay. So then you want that flavor? Orange. You want lemonade and then orange? Yeah. And then did you get the milk out? No. Not yet. Yeah, I don't know how to pour it. <laughs> a little bit more lemonade, even though it's bedtime. We're teaching our daughter how to make mixed drinks. Yep. Ooh. Ooh pretty good. Is this going to be yummy, Ashley? Best part. That's the cream. Oh, here, that's the yummiest. I got one right here. Let's use a spoon. That's gonna be orange creamsicle with a little hint of lemon. Okay, try it. Okay. What do you think, Ashley? What do you, what is it? Is it good? Good. Really good. It's really good. Can I try a little? No, no, yeah, you don't need more. I don't know. I don't need more cream. It's creamy. Just didn't have much orange flavor 
Mas e homem acha? You good? All right, I just got out the drinks that we got for the girls to come home to. There's just a little bit of vanilla. This one's my favorite. The blackberry, I like it with the ginger ale, but I'll do it with the Sprite, the blackberry, and then the half and half. That one's pretty good. I could do a little bit of vanilla Coke. I've got my Coke right here. I could do a vanilla, right, or coconut. That would be kind of good, but I'm just gonna finish my drink. Okay, it's time for you to go to bed though. These balloons are pretty cute up here. Those turned out really fun, right? Did you have fun at the beach? Being part of the big girls group? Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't as fun because we didn't have any kids there to play with, huh? All right, you're going to bed after you drink that sugary drink. <laughs> you ran inside the cup. <laughs> All right, change of events here. Got something wrong with the Keep fridge. The trash, yeah. Can you see what's under there? Oh, you covered it up, but that's like filled with mold and water. Oh, Holy cow. Oh, crap. Give me a towel. That's so gross. Yeah, they're right down here. Here. These want me to get towels and... Yeah, just start pulling it out. It's so gross. We don't know if something's leaking in there. I don't even know what's back here. How can it even get here? I don't know. All right, we're having to pull everything out of the freezer. This is going to help us do inventory. <laughs> But we're cleaning this out now. Here, let me see you underneath here now. So we're trying to clean out and figure out what's leaking under there. All right, so now we're gonna pull the fridge out. We have a lot of garbage, gross towels. We've gotta to sort through and put in the wash. All right, so we're just cleaning everything up. We pulled the fridge out. Didn't see any more leaks behind it, so we're just gonna have to keep an eye on it. This is the tray where we saw most of the mess underneath. This is the yogurt tray, so we're gonna have to keep pulling it out and check on it. Sorry, the kids are watching their movies still. So.